All right, well, it's vlog number 30. I've been doing this for 30 days straight now. Uh, so thank you guys so much for watching these videos. I really, really appreciate it. It's been awesome. Um, but I am gonna have to take somewhat of a pause and start doing vlogs every other week or every week. Uh, today, I'm gonna be more likely having my second child today. So I have a lot of things going on. Um, so I wanna go ahead and give myself time to take care of my family and be there. Um, and continue the business and everything like that. Uh, I'll still be taking care of rentals, but any junk removal jobs or anything like that will be getting taken care of uh, by my uh, crew members. Um, so, I mean, as far as the journey, I've, I've enjoyed it. It's been awesome showing you guys every single day of what I've been doing in my business. And it also marks the 30th day of being in the, uh, you know, uh, dumpster rental business and how it's been for me. Now, I really enjoy the dumpster rental business, but as anything else, whenever you're in business, uh, you have to be very patient and let your business build and you have to, you know, focus on it and build it from the ground up. You know, you can't just always hire somebody uh, and they're just going to help you build your business or take care of everything for you. Uh, you got to get in it and build it yourself. All right. So whenever you're, you know, starting your business or if you already have your business, uh, you know, kind of common sense, but try to build relationships with uh, people that you do business with. So homeowners, uh, you know, real estate people, um, other business people and things like that, because it really, really helps. And that's what's really going to help grow your business, because those are going to be the people that are going to recommend you, call you and things like that. So, for instance, uh, I ended up landing a rental today because I did a job for a realtor. I did a really good job for the realtor and I did a whole home clean out and everything like that. And whenever the realtor asked me for other, you know, other services, I went ahead and recommended them to other people or I set things up for them and things like that. And, you know, now that they um, are doing the renovation at this property that I cleaned out, they're calling me to go ahead and start setting the dumpsters. So that continues our business relationship as far as not only do, will I offer cleanouts and demo, I can provide them with dumpster rentals. So when the contractors go in and they do their work, uh, you know, they're continue using my business and everything like that, which can end up meaning you can start doing business with not only the realtor, but for the real estate company that they're working for. And there's a ton of real estate companies and a ton of realtors, and there's plenty of work for everyone. But right now I'm gonna go ahead and pick up one of my team members, and then we're gonna go ahead and drop off this dumpster for a rental. And then we're gonna go pick up our other team member and then we're gonna pick up an empty dumpster and uh, we're gonna go do a, a junk removal. And then I'm gonna hook onto another dumpster and then go put it on rent and then come back and help them finish that job. And uh, once we're done with that job, we have another job. And once we're done with that job, I believe there's another job. So again, it's gonna be a busy day. I'm trying to finish up a bit early. That way I could go ahead and go to the hospital if I need to. Uh, for my wife and uh, so yeah we'll see what ends up happening all right so I'm here at the house uh, waiting on the contractor I texted the contractor okay but I never sent it so I had it all texted out like hey we're you know 20 minutes away whatnot all that stuff and then I didn't hear anything back so I thought and I was like huh I'll just wait till he texts me back and I was like man he's never texted me back because I went and stopped and got breakfast and then he texts me back hey are you still coming and then I went back to the messages and I never sent it. So now I'm waiting on him. So I got to wait here for about 15, 20 minutes till he gets here, uh, till we could drop this dumpster. Uh, Cause I want to make sure I drop it exactly where he wants it. I'm not just going to drop it uh, in the front or whatever, and then have to move it later. So I just wait for him. So I'm prepping the dumpster, getting it ready to go ahead and drop it off. Everything's unlocked, ready to go. So as soon as he gets here, he just points where he wants it. We'll drop it, invoice is ready to go. And yeah, so it'd be pretty simple once it gets here. All right, there you have it. First rental of the day. It'll be a uh, three to five day rental, but he says he'll probably be done with it by the end of today. So I'll just pick it up tomorrow if that's the case. All right, so I made the mistake of going ahead and showing up early. This job is scheduled for tomorrow morning. Um, customer thought it was gonna be like a you know one big load uh but it actually ended up coming out to be you know less than even half a load like a quarter load but anyways we're already here he's cool with us starting so we're gonna go ahead and start 
All right, so we're back here at the donation center and we're gonna be uh, donating some of the items because a lot of the items were in good condition. Uh, it has a TV stand, a sewing machine, and some other items. All right, so I'm here at the landfill right now where we're gonna go ahead and dump that load. There's some trash in the bed of the truck as well. Right now I have the guys going ahead and getting everything ready to go ahead and dump. I'm gonna pull forward, everything's gonna come out and then they're gonna offload the bed of the truck. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and look at the schedule and go ahead and get things ready for the next job and uh, you know go ahead and make a post or something like that on my Google My Business account. Well, once we're done with this, I'll go ahead and give the customer a 15 to 30 minute notice. Uh, that way we can go ahead and drop this dumpster uh, for a rental. All right, well, I went ahead and had to reschedule everything. Uh, my wife's gonna go ahead and begin, uh, you know, the process of going into labor. So I need to go ahead, head back home, pack a bag, stay the night at the hospital for however long it takes. Um, rescheduled everything for tomorrow. Had another rental call in for tomorrow morning. Uh, so I'm gonna have to drop that off first thing in the morning. Um, hopefully, you know, we'll see what happens. If not, uh, my brother and I will step in and he's gonna be taking care of everything on the business end as far as getting jobs done with our other crew member as well. Thank you guys so much for watching these videos. I really, really appreciate it. I got a lot of things going on. I'm gonna continue making vlogs. They're just not gonna be daily vlogs. They're gonna be weekly vlogs for the most part. And then I'll be able to make more videos, more content about other things within the business and give, giving out tips and stuff like that. So thank you so much. I really appreciate it. If you like these videos, please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I really, really appreciate it. I'll see you at the next one. Thank you. Bye-bye.